They couldn't wait to get in. And who could blame Sixers fans tonight? This is what it's all about. Playoff basketball in South Philadelphia is special. And those we spoke with said, a win tonight. This is our series. I don't know how they're going to do it, but they're going to do it. The main player is going to get theirs. MB is going to get his. Uh, the Beer is going to get his. Uh, Max is going to get his. Okay. Harris is going to have a good game. So we get a little bit of help from the bench. It's all over. And tonight it was a family affair. The Sixers were making memories that will last a lifetime. For these two, it was an impromptu trip tonight to the Wells Fargo Center. James was so excited when I showed him the tickets last night. We made it a surprise. For the Rathgate family, it's another chapter of many watching Sixers basketball. I love it. I come to every game. I bring my kids down, my wife. I mean, it's my favorite sport in the best city in the country. Awesome, guy. We're always here for the play. But it was not the start we had hoped for. The first two quarters were uncharacteristically sluggish. At halftime, the Sixers were down 49-44, and fans were feeling a little uneasy. You're worried. Yeah, I'm worried. Yeah, because they ain't playing like they used to. They need better perimeter defense. JoJo need to either, as soon as he get the ball, he got to either go straight to the paint or pass it. We need more motion. They being stagnant. They drop a game here. They drop a game there. Sixers and five. You know what I'm saying? Let's go, boys.